All right, let's try this stuff out. See in my kit editor. Let's add a new one called uh, test kit. There we go. And let's add an item into it and turn it on. A cooldown can be zero or one second. That's fine. No cost or anything. Everything else is fine, I think. All right. So, um, nope. Um, LP group default permission set CMI kit test kit, I think. Would that allow it? I don't know. Let's try it out. Here we have this setup. Some kits. Oh, I don't um, see my kits. See my kit? There we go. Sorry. Yay, I got it. Okay, so that works. Back to the other one. Let's create something else. CMI Enchant Unbreaking 5. CMI Hide Flags Hide Enchants. CMI Item Name um, um, Juicy Leather Stuff. CMI Item Lore for Line 1 is Thank you for getting this kit see my item lore line 2 for uh, username owns this there we go see my item lore line 5 cannot be traded really okay what do we have we have this thing now we go to see my kit editor where we open up the test kit and take this one out, put this one here, and let's try it as the other player. There we go. Party room owns this. Party room owns this, and this is party room. The placeholder works, the lore are there. Um, colors seem to work and um, the title and everything is there as well um, that's how I would use it